Hey, what's up guys? I just got done um, completing week one of my online personal training videos and I wanted to share a stretch that I added onto one of these videos. So here we go. Um, we're gonna focus on this stretch to help you with your splits. And this is a stretch that's really easy to do. You can do this all the time. And, I, and before we get into the stretch, I wanna share with you where I learned this. As you guys know, I've been doing uh, competitive martial arts for eight years. I took a break at the end of 2015, and I'm not going back to martial arts anytime soon, but I will return eventually. I'm not into um, competitive fighting at the moment, but at the time when I was, I was at a, a fair, a health fair, just walking around, I was by myself, and I saw a Taekwondo master, and or he might've been karate guy, and I went up to him and I said, Hey, can you do the splits? And he said, yes. And I said, what's the best stretch to help you with the splits? Because I've seen YouTube videos and I've seen a lot of different stuff, but I've never seen this. So this is gonna be completely new to a lot of people out there. And this is great to learn your stretch, not only for self-defense so you can kick higher, but also you wanna be more um, flexible than the guy that you're defending yourself against, you know? just in case he's on top of you or just in case you have to move in different situations. So it's very important to be able to be flexible in this type of movement. So we'll get straight into it. Sorry it took a minute and 40 seconds of talking, but let's get, let's get to it, okay? So you're gonna be in this position to start. Legs here, if you, if you could stand here, you're already good. Your left elbow will touch the inside of your left knee, boom. Your right elbow will touch the inside of your right knee. Your hands will go straight down. I got a fractured wrist, so I don't do this. I do this or I do this, okay? So we're gonna go straight down here and you're gonna lean forward and allow your body weight to stretch out. And you don't wanna put too much pressure forward. You'll break your, your arm that way. Keep your arm bent and just stretch down. Don't look up, it's bad for your neck. I will look up slightly for the video, but you want to let your body pressure. See my body here, it's leaned forward here, see? I'm leaning forward. My back is almost like a, uh, a table almost, not exactly. See, I'm actually like this, but if I wanted to, I could be like this, but it's actually, about 45 degree angle here so just allow your body just to rest here and just stretch and just hold on it's a static stretch the more weight you put on it the more you put your body down the more gravity will pull you in and you'll be able to stretch harder and stretch as much as you want the farther back you go the less stretch you're gonna get the more lower and more pressure you put down the farther you're gonna stretch and my elbow is going like that I'm stretching out okay so hope you guys like that it's a great stretch I love it I do it all the time because I don't like stretching my legs out all the time because there's not enough room most of the time so it's great to add to every exercise hope you guys like it let me know what you think on the comments and have a great day have a great night wherever you're at and God bless you